welcome welcome thank you so much for subscribing to this youtube channel okay so today's news is all about um the court case against ademola Adele kim on the just concluded election during july 16 in ocean state so we heard that um Oyetola, you know went to court took um Adele kim to court you know to bring him down so let's really dive into the news the headline ocean tribunal Others substituted service on Adili Kim. The election peti petition, petition tribunal, hearing the petition arising from the July 16 governorship election in Oshun State, has granted an order allowing the petitioners, Governor Adeboyega Oyetolo, Oyetola, and the All Progressive Congress to serve the governor elect Ademola Adeliki through a substituted means. Hmm. The petitioners had as, as approached the tribunal, alleging that Adeliki had been evading service of the notice of court proceedings. The chairman of the tribunal, Tatsi Oga Kum, granted the order as prayed by the petitioners and ordered that the process be served on Adeliki by pasting it, it on the court notice board. The tribunal also granted the prayer to inspect the election materials and to conduct electronic scanning of voters' registers and ballot papers. Lead counsel to the petitioners, Yomi Aliu San, noted that the first respondent, Independent National Electoral Commission, that is INEC, and the third respondent, People's Democratic Party, PDP, have been served, but Aleke Adeleke has been evading service. Hmm. So this is what we see now. After the APC lost in Ocean State, they still went ahead and took the matter to court, saying that Adeleke is not supposed to win, that he's not qualified to be a governor in Ocean State. So, you know, how can this be possible? It is known, like it's, it's an open secret that the election was not wished. That it was the people Adelike is the people's choice. So why is Oyetola still kind it on his head? Why is this still behaving like a wounded lion all around? Now let's look at what people are commenting on this. Ola go to me, Florence Kenny said, they are all stupid and big fools. Nobody will allow we running for them this time and one will go no. Okay, so this is according to Olawo to me. <laughs> okay. Love Dio said, not in people, they can pay any amount to scatter things. Troubles na die, na their own. They forget when I next said that APC won, PDP left them. You people should critically look at Nigeria since 2015. Now, wow. And oh my brother, they should look at what's happening. Since the APC have been winning since 2015, things have not been ever been the same way. Things has really changed for the bad. Okay, let's go to another person. The best law said, if they like, they should call for a running of election. Adelike will still win them. APC are mad dogs. Hmm. Not true, my brother, not true. Bafemi Ayodabo said, APC is gone in Ocean State. So as far as the people of Ocean State are concerned, because they went out and voted for Adelike. So people even, you know, they came along and were like, they collected money from the APC, but they later seen went to vote for the people. You can see how the APC are really desperate to win in Ocean State. But the people showed them that they have sense. They collected money and seen went to vote for PDP. So Adelika is the people's choice. So APC is gone in Ocean State. They should just go and try their luck in other states. So somebody is replying to Obafemi. He said, Amen. They will never win again. They are dead. Amen. <laughs> Adekumi Adegbenle said, Why this unnecessary noise? Once the party is served, the flag bearer has been served. Adelike cannot run away from being served court notice. Adebo Ega Oyetola and APC were wounded lions in the just concluded Oshun gubernatorial election. So Adelike should expect this. Yes. Adelike should expect this kind of reaction from APC and Boyega. Oyetola, because they never expected that they were going to lose. They believe that they own Nigeria. They believe that I want law come. So it's their turn to go. So they believe anybody that wins this election, whether 
um, the state of um, or the presidential election. That means the person. That means it was maybe it was a, a game. It, uh, it's not right. It's not supposed to be. They are shocked. That's what they are going to court against. Against you know the people. So please, please, and please. Oh, yeah, Tola, please accept defeat. People have been saying this. Accept your defeat and go and waste. You can come back for years and come and contest now. Leave this guy alone. He has already won the election. So leave him alone. Solomon Marco said, wasted effort. Hmm. Hmm. So I don't know if he's referring to um, Oye Tola, the PPC candidate, or he's referring to Adeleke, the PDP candidates. Okay, let me just summarize it. If you are referring to or you're told that, that means you are saying that no matter what he does, take him to whatever tribunal he wants to take him to. Adeleke has won. If you're talking to um, Adeleke, that means you are saying that after all the campaigns, after all you know, people came out to rightly vote for him, he has been. This is, an, this is a wasted effort. I don't know what you. You know, let's just clarify what you are saying, sir. So, show me the way we reply to this man. Are you sure it is a wasted effort? It is better he, Ademola Deleke, makes himself available and gets prominent lawyer. Hmm, I, I really reason with you, Shogun I really, I reason with you. Yes, so Adeleke should stop running away. He knew he won. People, they saw it now. It was online. It was on TV. People were watching it. So just go, go to the court, go to the tribunal, and, you know, get a very good lawyer. And God will help you in Jesus' name. Amen. So Adekumi is still replying to Shegun Dewey. He said, you would know that APC are just making a, f a foul cry. Let them drag this matter to Apex Court, the Supreme Court. As the Apex Court means the highest court. They will fail. This is sure. They rely on overvoting, which is not possible in the new electoral system. Hmm. Thank you, my brother, for this, for this um, opinion. Thank you. So Lawutimi is still replying to this. <laughs> <laughs> so we planning to share going we're saying if you will run hundred times it will still fall hmm hmm so this man is saying that Adelike is a white person no matter what they do he will still win Adelike will still win so Lapita said this is a good move by the tribunal and this is good for our democracy by the judiciary okay this man is bringing it from a new aspect from another light Yes, so for for those that for those that you know, lost in the election, they can still go to the tribunal and you know say that okay, this was not done right, this was not done right. But in this case of Oyetola, I think Aden Mola was rightly voted into power. So no need of going. Those people still going to court, they are just they just don't want to accept the fate. But it is good for in our democracy in democratic in this democratic setting that we can be able to go to the court to you know speak up if we are not being if we are not justified if we are not really how will i put this if we are sure that we are not dealt with in the right way like you know in the u.s donald trump also went to the court to speak that no this was not done in the right way so okay i, I love this you know this new light let's always comment so like Mona Kinsola said, what do you want lawyers to eat if you don't give them cases? <laughs> wow, please, all this comment, all this comment. This is really very <laughs> Yeah, different light coming up. So according to Suleiman Akinsola is saying that they should always go to court. Yes, they should always bring court cases. So lawyers will eat. I think this Suleiman, I think is a lawyer or he has um, a brother or sister, uncle and, or aunt who is a lawyer. So he's saying that if they don't have court cases. How will the lawyers eat? So, you know what? Uh, I really love the comment. Thank you so much. Please, let's comment on the comment side. Let's talk about this more. Why is the Yetola still walking up and down? You know, still looking for ways to bring down Adimola Adeleke. Is he not tired yet? Adeleke has won. There's nothing to, you know, talk about this. It was clear that it Adeleke was the people's choice. So, he shouldn't bother. You know going to the court so that's my opinion so let me hear your opinion let me know what you think about what is happening in ocean state concerning the election conducted on july 16 of 2020 2022 this year
so i'm waiting for your comments and please also don't forget to like in the comments in the line in just like our video channel and for those who have not subscribed please don't forget to subscribe click on the red button and subscribe thank you so much for listening thank you thank you thank you god bless